Hello, people. I am Javi Kuei. Joining me is Courtney Wright. Hello. We're going to look at Angal... Oh, I should have looked at that name beforehand. Okay. Angamali Diaries. Angamali Diaries. There we go. Angamali Diaries. Uh, official trailer filmed by Lee, Lee Joe Jose Pelissari. I'm doing awesome today with the names. <laughs> So let's look at the IMDb real quick for Angamali Diaries. Vincent Pepe, who wanted to be a powerful leader of a righteous gang that ruled the city like his seniors. Well, that's an incomplete sentence. And then there's the rival clan with the malicious gangsters of Angamali, a locale on which the film is based. Okay, cool. <laughs> Making me hungry. Ooh, I know. I was like, wow, that looks delicious. That was a cool shot. Following them. Mm. That's how Houdini died. What? That's how Houdini died. Mm. Oh, just a. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> oh wow. That's my kind of movie right there. I thought it was hilarious when he just like open palm slapped him at the end. Oh yeah. That, that was really funny. Yeah, that was totally my kind of movie. It, it reminds me of an Indian film I saw called Gangs of Wasipur, which is actually on Netflix if you want to check it out. It's it was broke it's broken up into eight episodes. It was originally two really long movies. It's a mafia film set in Wasipur. This is a gangster film set in this in uh, um, Amala. On, on Gamali. It just looks really raw and visceral and it doesn't hold back on kind of the violence going on and the way these characters are treating each other, the dynamics that these people have. Between the men. Yeah, it's just, it's intense, and everyone's vying for power. Yeah, but at the same time, it's like, you can tell that this was a regular guy. He says, like, how many times have I been in trouble with the police? Never. And then something shifts, and something changes, and they're forced to, like, you know, when the market blows up. Yeah. You know, I loved how he told the woman that our lives are gonna change. It's not gonna be anything like it was before. So you're automatically setting up the problem that these people are gonna are fighting for. Right, and from a uh, technical standpoint, I love the music. I thought the music was really, really cool. That's some music I would just love to listen to like on my own because it sounds so cool. And it's I supported. Yeah, I like I like the contrast uh, with the kind of visceral action because it's kind of this calming, fun music and you see just kind of this intense imagery that it's going along with. I'm always a fan of that kind of stuff. Like in Face Off, when John Woo used Somewhere Over the Rainbow as the house is being <laughs> blown up. I'm like, this is awesome. I'm a big fan of that kind of like contrast. The cinematography was beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. So very well shot. Anyways, you guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us. Please check out Courtney Wright on the social media. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out our other reactions, reviews, short films, and video game related videos. I'm Jabby Kawai. This is Courtney Wright. Peace out.